and rise to fame. <clears throat> Hello, everybody, and welcome to another Verbling.com English class. In this hour, we're going to be having a speaking class, and we're going to be playing the game 20 Questions. So I have played this game before with students, and uh, they seem to like it, so it's a good way to just have something different to talk about. It's really good for asking questions and practicing asking questions in the proper format. A lot of time we can, um, a lot of times we can get away with, you know, stumbling through a question and the other person will probably understand what we're saying. But if you can ask the question correctly, then that helps you become more fluent and speak uh, more correctly. So if you would like to join, you can join now. If you have a reservation, uh, then you can use that now. Just click on the Join Class button, and you will be able to come in. Um, I know that there's another class with Josh that was just finishing up, so there might be some people um, coming in pretty soon, like Rocio. Hi, Rocio. How are you? Hi. I'm very well. How about you? Good. How's Spain? Yeah, it's good. It's good. Sunny. It's Christmas and it's sunny. It's strange, but it's nice. <laughs> very nice. Sunny. Yeah. Nice. That's nice. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, yes. Rocio, are you, where are you? What city are you in? Uh, Madrid. Madrid. Okay, Madrid. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I can remember. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Is is Does it ever snow there? Not very common that it snows in, in Madrid. It used to snow in the mountains in the north of Spain, but Madrid, yeah, it, it snowed uh, last month, just mm -hmm. for a day. Okay. But it doesn't, the sun doesn't last very much. Oh, okay. Because yeah. of traffic, yeah. Traffic, and it's not yes. really that cold, right? Yes, yes, exactly. Okay. okay. Yeah, I was wondering. I've been looking at the temperatures from different cities, and Spain stays pretty warm. I mean, Madrid. Madrid. Yes. Yeah. Madrid, yeah. Cool. Okay, welcome, Yuki. Hi, Yuki. How are you today? Fine, fine. Thank you. <laughs> How Did you have some Japanese classes today, Yuki? Yes, today we, uh, we have classes. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes. Um, How did it go? Did you did you have to leave your house early to get there in time because of the snow? Uh, 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 yes. Um, but today today uh, I have uh, classes in my house, so in my in my apartment. So oh. I have private classes. Uh, well, yes. That's nice. They have yes. to come to you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, okay. Cool. That's nice. All right, and Kirvan, how are you doing? Kirvan? Hi, I am Hi. fine, thank you. Good. What time is it in Turkey right now, Kirvan? It is 9 p.m. Okay, not too bad. <laughs> not too late. Yeah. Yeah, good. Yeah. It is early. Uh-huh, good. And Alexandra, how are you? How are you? Fine, fine. Thank you. And you? Good. Alexandra, remind me where you're from. I'm from Spain, like okay. Rocio. Like Rocio, okay, that's from what Mallorca. I thought. From, from Mallorca. From Mallorca, oh. Yeah, where your sister's living. Uh-huh, yes, Your sister, yes. no, your, your, your sister? She is the, um, well, when I was 15, I lived in Spain, and I lived with two different host families. So she was my sister in the host family. So she's Spanish, and Ooh. she lives in uh, Mallorca. Her name is Veronica. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, nice and sunny there, I bet. You no, know, now, now, well, no, in this moment, it's very oh. cold <laughs> and oh, humidity. <okay. laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, a sunny day today is uh, like around... 15 degrees. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm so not really but hot. Today, but yeah. No, 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 no. Yeah. Because in the in the Iceland, it's very uh -huh. humid. Uh -huh. And the, in the island, and yeah. the cold sensation is mm -hmm. very higher. Is it um is it windy on the island? Windy. What is windy. it? 
uh, when you have a lot of wind, viento. You have mm, a lot of wind. Uh, yesterday we have a lot of wind. Mm -hmm. uh, north okay. uh, from the north. Mm -hmm. Okay. And today no, today it's very calm in this sense. Oh, okay. Nice. So, are people coming to Mallorca now for vacations, or what no, is no, the? No, 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 not the, now. The season, the tourist season, mm -hmm. uh, starts at April and ends uh, in October, first uh, November. Oh, okay. uh, cur currently, it's all is closed. Mm -hmm. The hotels and uh, bars, restaurants, uh, all is closed. Oh really? So it's it's, it's totally no. It's very sad. It's very sad because oh. you 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 go to the street and all is all is closed. It's wow. very different different like uh, Madrid or Barcelona. Yeah, yeah. I didn't I didn't know. My town is a touristy town. So, um, but we always have you know nine thousand people live here and everything still is open. It's just that when the tourists come in the summertime, you know. There are maybe twenty thousand more people every day, or something. I don't know, but um, but we never close up. It's just slow. We call it just dead slow. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> yeah, but okay. And um, I have one more question for you about that before we get to the game. Uh, oh, Yuki has a question too. I was wondering about Russian tourists because um, Veronica was telling me she was starting to learn German and Russian yeah, yeah, because yes, of yes, the yes, yes, yes. Um, in in near my home, uh, it mm -hmm. will start uh, uh, intensive course course mm -hmm. of Russian. Wow! Because it is because uh, currently and uh, future future I talking about the next one year two years. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The second alternative to German people mm -hmm. will be uh, Russian people. Wow! Oh. And what it's about, very important to to mm -hmm. be uh, good opportunities, uh, job opportunities, uh, uh, have a good a good uh, level for Russian. What about um, um, British people? Do British people come to Mallorca? Yes, uh, first the first one are German German okay. tourists. The second one are um, English people. Oh, okay. At the third position, uh, the last years are uh, Spanish people, but the Spanish market are going down because mm. of, for the, cra the economic crisis. Uh -huh. And uh, the market uh, it's searching, it's keeping the different markets around mm -hmm. the world, and they they think or I thought they thought. Mm -hmm. That the Russian market is the the more best because the Russian people like the sun, the beaches, and all of the products yeah. like Mallorca uh, got it. Okay. But so Chinese they... Chinese people because another one uh, says the Chinese market is more better, but the Chinese people don't doesn't like the sun and the beach. Oh. Yes, yes. Oh, and what about the Japanese people? Yuki is from Japan. Uh. Uh, before uh, I I had worked in a tourist agency. Oh really? Moscow. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Uh, my job is uh, attending uh, uh, tourism for uh -huh. Japanese for Japanese. Uh, oh. And Mallorca is quite uh, quite popular spot for Japanese. Mm -hmm. uh, but not not all Japanese uh, people who 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 are who who has uh, good knowledge uh, about tourism uh, appreciate high uh, Mallorca mm. um, um, so not so um, um, Mallorca is um, unfortunately not so uh, famous, uh, famous. Uh, not so famous for Japanese but, mm -hmm. but to some tourists uh, uh, appreciate very high Mallorca. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, but uh, it's normal the people who who is from a long con uh, very far con countries from from Spain mm -hmm. when comes to Europe they prefer 
visit the principal cities like Barcelona, Madrid, mm -hmm. and Paris, Roma, mm -hmm. because they they start a, a, tri a tour, and yeah. the other the other cities the um, more more or less uh, an important population. Mm -hmm. uh, the Japanese market does, doesn't doesn't come, but yeah. I, I saw it uh, little groups. And they they like it so much the culture and the gastronomy that's that's better for yes, for the, yes. the Japanese people like it. But Yuki, if you Japanese want to to come to come to Mallorca, you will yes, you yes. will you will you will uh, you will have a, a job sure because a lot of schools are are searching are searching uh, Russian Russian teachers. Yes. Ah. Uh, thank you. Uh, uh, Japanese Japanese are uh, used to uh, high quality of service. So I think uh, I think uh, um, you have to you have to prepare uh, good quality of service for Japanese tourists. And regarding Russian tourists, uh, before uh, one of the most popular uh, tourist spots. For Russians, was Kipros, island Kipros. Uh, but Kipros now has an economic crisis. After after the crisis, uh, Russian tourists, a number of Russian tourists, uh, reduced uh, very very much reduced. So it is, I think, it is the chance to attract Russian tourists to your country. To my mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yes, that's what's what's what I miss about being uh, in Europe is that it's it's pretty easy to uh, travel to other countries. Being here in the United States, I'm in Washington State, and if I even if I fly five hours or so, I'm only getting to New York. <laughs> so, and, and it's still basically America. So. I want to go back to Europe because it's fun to be able to be one day in Spain, the next day in France or Germany or you know Greece or something like that. So, you you guys are lucky. <laughs> okay. All right. Welcome to Claudio. How are you today? Hey, Lisa. I'm great. Thank you. All right. Cool. So, has everybody played the game before? I think. Most no, I don't. You have an Alexander. Okay, so this is a it's a fun uh, game. It's kind of pretty simple, but the way it works is we have twenty. Is going to start by thinking of something in their mind. So you can think of like dog, for example, and then the rest of us we're going to ask you questions. They're going to ask you questions and you're going to answer with a, a yes or a no. So the questions should be the type of questions that you can answer with a yes or a no. Um, and the strategy of the game is to try to ask really good questions that narrow it down. So rather than you know just start guessing is it a dog, is it a cat, is it a banana or something like that, we want to ask questions that will help us eliminate other possibilities. Um, and then we have 20 questions to guess. And then we'll see if we can figure it out um, before that time is up. <clears throat> the type of questions that are common, something like, does it swim in the ocean? Does it have two legs? Does it have four legs? Can you drive it? Is it man-made? And in terms of for an English class, one of the ideas for the class is that it helps you to uh, practice making good questions or formulating the questions in a correct, a grammatically correct way. So a lot of times we can ask questions and people will understand what we're saying, but a lot of times it can be difficult to ask them in the proper way. So that's what we're going to practice. So I might either if you say a question I might either write it a different way in the verb link chat or I might say it and I'm also going to keep track in the chat if the answer is a yes or a no 
So a couple of things to remember is if you are a person who is guessing, I mean if you're the person if you are the person who has the thing in your mind, try not to make it too difficult. Sometimes we have had some people who try to make something that's very um, difficult, very obscure, you know, like mm -hmm. something that we don't really even know what it is. So it, it's better um, if we can, if you can think of something that's, you know, in your house or something that people would know, not so like crazy that we wouldn't even know what the name of it is or where you would find it or anything like that. So it's like common things. Mm -hmm. Okay, does anybody have any questions? No. Nope. Pretty no, no. easy? It's okay. Clear. It's clear. Pretty clear. Okay. So uh, who wants to think of something? Anybody want to think? be the person to think of something first? You will be the person answering yes or no to the questions. Well, I, I will start. Okay, we have a volunteer. Good, thank you. All right, so Alexandra, I start by um, the first question that narrows it down is whether it's an animal, a vegetable, or a mineral. So I want to make sure we all understand these first. So an animal includes all types of animals, even reptiles, mammals, birds, and humans, all different types of animals. A vegetable is a category that includes all types of food. So anything that's that's grown, like real vegetables, fruits, it can be grown as a plant, a bush, a tree, um, anything like that. And then mineral is pretty much everything else. So it's kind of like a catch-all category. So if it's not an animal and it's not a vegetable, and a vegetable can be fruit, remember, it can also be plants and stuff, then it's a mineral. So anything that is man-made, like a car or something, that would be considered um, a mineral. So it's kind of a broad uh, topic. It okay, has so to be a common thing, isn't it? Yeah, usually it's more fun if it's a common thing and we, we have a chance <laughs> of guessing it. <laughs> okay. okay. Um... Yeah. So then you, you think of it and then tell me, is it animal, vegetable, or mineral? Mm. Hi, Andre. Uh, okay. You have it? Uh, ani okay. Uh, animal. Okay, it's an animal. Okay, Andre, do you uh, did you hear what I was saying when I explained how to play the game? Uh, yeah, a little bit. Okay, I'm going to start with Yuki as the first person who asks the first question, and mm -hmm. we will go from there. So we know it's an animal. Yuki, what is your first question? Uh, it, uh, is it, it, uh, does it work uh, by, two le by two legs? By, by legs? By two legs? Wait, two legs or... Or legs in well, general. Yeah, uh, two legs. Okay. <laughs> so does it say. have two legs? Let's just say. How to say? How how? Do, does it can have repeat, two legs? Can you repeat the, the the question? Does he? Or does it? Does it have two legs? Or four legs? Two legs. Two legs. Yes. Two legs. Yes. Okay. So uh, it's have it's uh it's have a, it's. Ha it have. has. It has. It two has. Legs. <coughs> okay, uh, so how, how to say? How to say? Does it walk by two legs? Well, two I would legs? say, um, does it walk, walk on two legs? On. Yeah. Ah. Does it walk on two legs or does it walk with two legs? Can Can I ask again, uh, Alexandra? Does it walk on two legs? Yes. It yes. walks in two legs. Mm -hmm. On two legs. On two legs. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Or with two legs. Yeah. Okay, so we're pretty clear. It has two legs. Rocio, what's your question? Hmm. I, I think it's easy, but the word maybe nobody knows. <laughs> no. it's easy, Have we seen? It's easy. It's easy. It's easy. Nobody knows? 
So it's an animal that uh, walks with two legs. Uh, yes. Is it a kangaroo? No, uh, uh, it isn't. Okay. Okay. Kervan. Yeah, does it <coughs> generally eatable? Is it edible? Can you eat edible. it? Yes, you you can eat it. Oh. Okay, yes. Claudio? Okay. Um, th does it has fur in its hair in its uh, face? Does it have fur on its face? On on its face. What do you say? Fur. Fur. Do you know fur? Uh, like hair. Like hair on oh, its here, face? Here, here. Like here. Like a bear, uh, in, for example. In, 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 the, in, the, in the face. In, yeah. On, on his fa it face. No, no. No. Yeah, it doesn't. Okay, so no hair on the face, or no fur. No fur, no fur in his face. Fur. On uh -huh. the face. Uh-huh. Andre. Uh, maybe is is it a bird? Or? No, it, 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 it. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> is it uh, a bird? I know. No. No. No, not a bird. Yuki. Uh, no, oh, oh, mm, mm. Mm, mm. But not a bird. That's interesting. Not bird. Eh, not a bird. I, I, I think a chicken. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I thought a chicken. Uh, <laughs> I have a question. Uh, mm, uh, Remember, it can be it, any that, any kind of animal. Does it to run fast? Uh, sorry. Does it, can it, uh, run, can does it run fast? Mm, sometimes. Uh, can I say some something else? Yeah. Uh, sometimes it's uh, run uh, relaxing and sometimes it's run very fast. Okay. If if you go behind him or behind behind hit, uh -huh. it it uh, starts uh, run very very quickly. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. I get. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so it's difficult so to let no, 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 no. <laughs> Is it a is it a human? Is it a human. Human mean. No, 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 no. No human? No. How, how can it be an animal without fur in fur in the fur, face? Fur but uh, fur, just a second. Fur is, fur, fur is a hair? Like yes. a hair or yes, yeah. It is edible. Wow. Well, the fur is like a skin. <laughs> fur, yeah. is like fur is not no. skin. Fur is like hair. Why like a dog it? has fur. No. Like the, 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 fur. the hair, uh, hair like a dog. No, 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 it isn't. Okay, doesn't have fur. All right. Doesn't have fur on its face. I don't know. It's fur. Oh, in face and all the body. Okay, no fur anywhere. <laughs> anywhere? Uh, uh, no fur anywhere. No fur anywhere. Like so uh, the fur, like fur, like a dog or like a cat. Yeah, that's yeah. Like, not like a not 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 this. Okay. Like Maybe we have a confusion here. I I think uh, you said that oh. it runs it runs on uh, two it, uh, legs. Two or legs. It has yeah. or, or it has two legs. It has two legs and it runs. Sometimes fast, sometimes slow. But not a bird. But not a bird. Mm. Strange. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm looking. I'm looking. <laughs> Except for this is weird because it gives you like all these 
animals that have lost their legs. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that, that, that pig with two legs. Yeah, that's crazy. I know only one. Uh, it's the ostrich. Ostrich, I think. Ostrich. It's not. It, it, but it's it's, but it's it's a bird. It's a bird. I think. It's hard. Yeah, I saw one. it. You saw it in the picture? Yes. Oh, okay, here we go. It's on one of these pictures here. Mm. Oh. But it's not a bird. It's not a bird. Mm. 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 So, so, uh, Kervan, do you have a question? We can think about, like, the size, and we can think about... And you can't eat it, so... Yeah, and you can't eat it. Okay. No. Uh, you can eat. eat uh, you can uh, eat. eat it, yes. You edible. Eat it. Edible. Yes. Edible. Mm, uh, is, uh, is it a large animal? Is it a large animal? Mm, good question. Alexander? Uh, is it a large animal? No, it's a little one. Mm. Mickey Mouse. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, the the Mickey the question about is uh, the question is about uh, is is it um, a bird or not? Maybe maybe is a hybrid. 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 Oh. Okay. Uh, oh, somebody wanted to know: Is it an ostrich? Do so you know which one is an ostrich? I, oh, I no. think I already asked. It's not. That's a bird. That's an ostrich. It's not an ostrich. No. Okay. No. It's in the first in the first line. What? Yes. First it's line of pictures. Oh. Okay, guys. You have a question? He says it's in the first line of pictures there. Oh. Human. <laughs> no. Is it a penguin or no? My bird, bird. So you can eat it. Maybe. Yes, and they put different little ones, and you can eat it too. Hmm. Oh, is it a duck? So it's a hen. Not a duck, but it's similar. Yeah, you duck. can you can eat the, the the eggs. So it's a yeah. oh. it, it's a it's a hen. Is it a hen? Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it has fur in in, in the face. It has and it's fur a in the bird. face. No, and but it's a bird. we we say that uh, this word it's, it's the similar hair like a dog or like a, no, it's a, like yeah, a cat. It's a bird. It doesn't have fur. It I has feathers. The chicken. I it, said it chicken. Yeah, it's a bird. But it's it has bird. feathers. Uh, yeah. but, um, <laughs> kind of. I mean, right on its face, it's kind it's of like skin. Yeah. I, said, mm, I think it's a hybrid, huh? Between what? They no, don't, don't fly. It's not, it's not well, you say, what? But when you say a bird, uh -huh. you say uh, an animal who can fly. No, no birds. No, bird. no. Yeah. No. I th I th no. Well, the animals can fly. I mean, the chickens can fly a little bit. They can't fly <laughs> yes. like a bird, yeah. but yeah. a little bit, yes, a little bit, yes. They can. And also yeah. They sometimes bird, do yeah. that. Yes. Yeah. It is a species of a bird, but it, oh, it's called okay. a fowl. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> no problem. It was it was funny. It was funny wondering. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm a, I'm an in, an in ignorant. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I never, I never related with the uh, bird. Yeah, yeah. No. Okay. Yeah, it's considered a bird, and you're right about the face. It, I wouldn't say it has. You can't say it has a uh, fur on it, but oh. it has like fat. You know, the face of a. Because if you look really closely, you can see it has a little bit of like what we would call. These are the feathers, even though they're very, very mm -hmm. fine and very mm -hmm. small. But still, those would be considered feathers. But it also has this very rough skin. So, this red, rough skin. So, yeah, he was right there. It wouldn't be really like fur, like dogs or cats or 
other types of animals like that. But yeah. All right, chicken. Chicken and the egg. <laughs> okay. Rocio, do you want to guess um, something for us? Uh, okay. Uh, give me a second. Yeah, sure. Try something. <laughs> it's a funny one. Mm, I mean, I'm trying to look for something really, really easy. Okay. Yeah, because the possibilities are huge. So yeah, it can be difficult. Yeah, yeah. In the meantime, we'll look at all these chicken faces. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I I have to And we'll one. we'll think about what we're gonna eat. My mm. after I have this, I have lunch. So we'll see what I have for lunch. <laughs> Look at that one. That's crazy. Mm. Okay. Yeah. All right. You have one? Is it an animal? Yes. It's an animal? No. No. Vegetable or mineral? Yes, vegetable. Okay, vegetable. Okay, Alexander, why don't you start with the first question for Rocio about uh, trying to guess a vegetable. Uh -huh. Uh. Uh, I need to know. Mm. Yeah, let me remind everybody. So, in the vegetable category, it can be a food. It can be something that grows. So, it can be a vegetable, like we have, you know, zucchinis, cucumbers, things like that, lettuce. But it could also be a fruit. So, it could be a banana or an apple or grapes or something like that. And it could also be a plant or a flower or a type of a tree, like, you know, bamboo or, you know, a rose. Something like that. All of those types of things are included in the category vegetable. So we can start narrowing it down by asking some questions for her. So that will help us. It is a, a dried fruit. Is it a dried fruit? I don't know what is dried, but it's not a fruit. Okay. What is dry? Ah, dry it, dry it. Okay, I understand now. No, no, it's not the fruit. All right, now that helps eliminate a lot of things. All right, so we eliminated all the fruits. Uh, Andre, what do you? What is your question? Uh, does it have a round shape? All right. Does it have a round shape? I don't know. I don't. Can you or type it, is please? It round. Yeah. Is it yeah, round? It you know what round is? Like a watermelon round, yeah. or something? An orange? No, 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 no. No, no not no. round. Okay, Claudio. Is it an actual vegetable? Yes. Okay, so is it an actual vegetable? Yes. So it is a vegetable. Okay, Kerman. It this will help us think. <laughs> is it edible? The same question again. Well, it is a vegetable. It's a vegetable, yes. So you can eat it. Yes, you can eat it. Yes, so it is edible. Yuki? Is it green? Is green it green? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, it's green. All right, that narrows it down even more. Okay, Alexander, a, a question of, that will help us figure out the green vegetable. Mm. Uh, it's it's large. Not very large. Not very large. <laughs> so no, it's not. Andre. Uh, is it a cucumber? No. Cucumber, no. Okay, Claudio? Mm, do you have to cook it before uh, eat it? No. I mean, you have to... No, never. So you can eat it raw? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Kervan? It's it very it, easy. Uh, it's very easy. Is, so I think is, everybody knows it. Is it uh, 
Chile. No, no. Yuki. Uh, is it red dots? Yes. 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 Great. Yeah. Great. <laughs> okay, that's yeah. a good one. What um, what kind of lettuce is popular to eat in Spain, Rosia? Well, uh, a lot of them because it's in fashion now because of the diets and things like that. And, uh -huh. and salads are in fashion in Spain, so you can have a lot of many, many different kinds of lettuce. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. It, it's interesting with lettuce because when I was a kid, um, there was just this kind of lettuce, just this. Yes, yes, yes. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Yeah. But but now lots the of people. The Yeah. Yeah. Now there's lots of different styles of, yeah. or, you know, types. Yeah. Yeah. Romaine lettuce and butter. There's all different names. Red leaf lettuce is yummy. Cool. Yeah. Is it popular yeah. to eat salad in Spain? Yes, yes, very, very course. popular. Yes, very mm. popular. With a lot of things, with cheese, with tomato, with corn, with mm -hmm. whatever you want. Yeah. Do you taste it? Uh, do yeah. you, Do you taste a uh, salad with uh, little pieces of apple? Yes, it's delicious. Very nice. Uh, yeah, very and mm. even with orange. Yes, orange? yes. Or, me yeah, or melon. Or yes, melon. Also. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, delicious. Yes. Yeah, I we um I used to own a cafe, but I'm not I'm not in the cafe anymore. I got out of that business. For, but um we made an apple walnut and cheese salad that was really yummy. Wow, wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the cheese and the walnuts and the apples together were pretty yummy. Yeah. Okay, Yuki, how about you uh, find something for us to okay. to discover? Vegetable. <laughs> okay, he's got it. <laughs> <laughs> he's on it. <laughs> Okay, Rocio, why don't you ask him the first vegetable? Okay, Category okay. is vegetable. Okay. All right, cool. Okay. Any question? Okay, yeah, can you eat it? Yes, it's okay. edible. Okay, it's edible. 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 Okay. Edible. 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 Okay. Edible means means you can eat it, but we don't say eatable. Okay. <laughs> All right, so edible. yes, it is edible. Yes, you can eat it. Kervan. Is it red? Is it red? No, it, it, it isn't red. No, it isn't red. Is it green? Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Now you're getting into it. All right. <laughs> Claudio. Okay, is it green? <laughs> <laughs> no, it isn't green. No, it isn't green. Andre, uh, is it uh, orange? Is it orange? <laughs> I mean, I mean, no. I mean, it doesn't have uh, or, or an orange color. color. Not not an orange. You, by you mean the orange color? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, no. Uh, you can call it red, but uh, I mean, no. <laughs> its color isn't isn't orange. Okay. Okay, so so it's not it orange. orange. In color. Okay, Alexander. Um, the um, are the rabbits eat a lot of them? <laughs> Do the rabbits eat a lot of them? I think rabbit uh, rabbit doesn't eat uh, rabbits don't eat uh, it. Okay. No. I no, think rabbits rabbit don't eat. Okay. That. Okay. Is it a fruit? No, it isn't fruit. Okay. A vegetable. Not a fruit. Okay, Kervan? Is it leafy? Hmm. What did you say? Is it leafy? Is it leafy, leafy vegetable? No, it is it 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 has on to leaf. No, okay, it, it it we can say it doesn't have any leaves. Leaves. Or okay. or it isn't leafy. It, okay. It itself, it itself hasn't leaf. Okay. Mm. Claudio? Um, hi, hi Tiago. Can, can you see the... The seas? The seas? The... The... Is it, is it green? Is it the yellow? Is it yellow? Oh. 
No, it isn't the color. It isn't yellow in color. Okay, no, not yellow. It's Andre? orange. It's orange, no. No, he no, said no. no he, it's no, not orange. No orange. Not orange. <laughs> not yellow. Uh -huh, and green. Okay. What, what did you say about green? No, not is green either. Red, no? Not green. No yellow. No orange. So red. Okay. <laughs> what? I don't, know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's not a fruit. It's is not it a fruit. Question? Ah. <laughs> I, I, saw, I thought that it's just category for, uh, I mean, vegetables. Category okay. is vegetable. Yeah, we don't know yet if it is a vegetable, actually. But okay. it's in the category of vegetable. So it's not, it's not a berry? I mean, any berry? berry. No. No, it, it isn't a berry. No. Mm -hmm. Okay, Alexander? Do, um, do it smells bad? Does it smell no. bad? It it hasn't a smell. It it doesn't have a smell. That I think it 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 has a little smell. Okay. Okay. It has a little a little smell. <laughs> Sorry. A little bit. Uh, okay. A little bit. Not a okay. We can say it doesn't have a strong smell. That doesn't mm -hmm. have a strong strong mm -hmm. smell. Mm-hmm. Uh, hi, Tiago. Exactly. Hey, Lisa. How are you uh, doing? Good. How are you doing? Great. Thanks. Hey, you're jumping in here. Do you want to ask Yuki a question? We're trying to figure out what he's thinking about. It's in the category of vegetable, but we know that it's uh, not a fruit. It doesn't have any leaves. It's not yellow. It's not orange. It's not green. And it doesn't have a bad smell. Man, what is that? <laughs> we don't know yet. <laughs> Is that a squash? I don't know. Is it a squash? Yuki? What is a squash? Okay, uh, there's lots of different types of squash. So squash is a big um, category, actually. So it can be like any of these types of things are squashes. Including no, no, zucchini. Squash. It's no. not a squash. It's not a pumpkin. Not a squash. It's not in the squash family. <laughs> it is not a squash. It is not a pumpkin. Okay. It sounds to me like like a sport. <laughs> well, it is a sport too. <laughs> it's both. But right now, it's really popular. It is popular. not a pumpkin. It is not zucchini. To eat. No. Yeah, those are all different kinds. So zucchini, pumpkin, Z delicata, Spaghetti squash, butternut Adol. squash. Those no. are all different names for different types of squashes. But it's I not know. one of those, so what else, Rocio? Well, is it red? Is it red? Hmm? Sorry. Is, is it, it red? Red color? What did you say? So I'm sorry. Red. Is it red? Red. Red. The red. color of red. Color the color is no. not no, red? It isn't red. It isn't oh my red. god, what color is it? <laughs> not green, not orange, not yellow, is no it, red. Is it purple? Maybe you already you asked, no? Red color, no? Uh, no. Second question, is it red? No. Uh, yeah, we already asked if yes, it's red, yes, yes. yeah. Uh, okay, ask another uh, question, Rocio. Uh, so, uh, do you have to cook it? Yes, we often cook it. Ah, mm -hmm. many people, many people are around the world. Okay, he's giving us a big clue. Okay. <laughs> you cook it. <laughs> okay, Kervan. Uh, uh, <laughs> does it grow under the uh, ground? Does it grow underground? Yes, it grow under. Um, I don't not not underground, uh, not underground. Like a potato would grow. It, it grows, it grows, but <laughs> not underground. Okay. All right, that's okay. Okay, Claudio. Does it has seeds on it? Uh, it has seeds. It has seeds. Oh yes, but very, very small seeds. Small size of the seeds. Okay, so it has very small seeds. Mm. Mm. Andre? 
Wow, it's difficult. No, not a bit difficult. You, you, maybe you use every day. Every day? <laughs> maybe, <laughs> maybe some, 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 some people. Mm, garlic. And we made Alex hungry. He had to go eat. <laughs> <laughs> it is very familiar, familiar, eatable food. It. Fa familiar food for you. Okay. Okay. Uh, and, and can you fry it or? Uh, yes, yes, uh, yes. Uh, it can be fried to cook. Hmm. So you have to cook it. Yes. Edible. Yes. It grows, so that's why it's yes. a, in the vegetable category, and everybody yes. eats it all the time. My f my wife often often fry it. Okay, Tiago. To make a dish. Um. Uh, which country is it from? Mm. Yeah. I don't well, know, yeah. sorry. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it, it only it's, exists it, in your back, no backyard. Man. <laughs> 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 it's difficult. It's it very difficult question. I'm, I'm sorry, I can't answer. Um, is it cassava? I'm sorry? What uh, is cassava? It? Cassava. I, I cassava? Cassava. Cassava. Right. cassava. Yeah, cassava. Is it a vegetable? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, don't know. cassava. But it, I don't think it would be popular enough because I think what he's thinking yeah. of is it's really popular. It no. Like a ah, cassava. Ah, cassava. no. It is not, it is not cassava. It is eggplant. Yes, it is eggplant. <laughs> <laughs> I can't <laughs> have got it. Good what? job. What? What is it? Excellent. Egg? What is a plant? Eggplant is eggplant. this right here. Eggplant. Do you know eggplant? Oh, okay. So yeah, papal. Yeah. Papal maybe, color. Okay. Maybe everyone know. Yeah? Uh, okay, 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 but, okay, okay. But I don't know. What. <laughs> yes, yes, that's very, very common here. Where, yeah, where yeah. are eggplant yeah. from? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe like yeah. uh, Mediterranean or something. I don't yes, know I eggplant. think Mediterranean. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe. Yeah. We always, okay, yeah. okay. Huh. Interesting. I don't know. They say that in in British English, it's known as uh, Auvergne. I don't even know what that Auburn is. Auvergne is okay. Also okay. But I don't. I would not know what that is if you told me that. So I have to say <laughs> eggplant. <laughs> I say, I say eggplant. Let's see here. Yeah, that that's yummy. It's, I don't, Indian, huh? I don't Indian, know. Maybe. Let's see, cultivated History. varieties. Europe and North America. Maybe from in, India. From the uh, Indian yeah. subcontinent, the is the Asia. Native yeah. To the India. Uh -huh. Subcontinent. Yeah. Which uh, a, a Yuki? Which type of eggplant is popular um, for you to eat? Is the white or the purple? In the big or the uh, skinny? I even don't. I don't know the white white eggplant. Uh, we are uh, the purple one are, only. We are used to, to cook uh, purple colors. Uh, Do you eat the big one that's round, like big like that, or the skinnier um, one like these I ones? I think it's quite a small one. Uh huh. Mm. Those kind. Yeah, um, I like it eggplant is, parmesan. That's a yummy dish. Wow. It is necessary yeah. yes. ingredient for ch Chinese Chinese cuisine. Oh, yeah, it's so pretty yummy. We often fry with oil. Uh huh. Yes. And uh, it's it's popular mm. in lots of different ways. Uh, <laughs> yes, oh. it, it it is also necessary for Italian food. Italian food, yeah. Mm -hmm. Kervan, yes. is it popular in Turkish food too? Yeah, it is mm. popular. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. How Claudio. do you call it? How do you call it in in Spain, Rocio? Yeah, how do you call that? Uh, berenjena. Berenjena. Ah, okay. Oh yeah, yeah. Berenjena. 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 Do you um, eat it, eat that, uh, Rocio? Yes, a lot of times. So fried or maybe with something. Uh, with some meat and and cheese like this, like this picture. Like that? Uh, yeah, no, the other one. With in in the oh. oven, you put it in the oven oh. with something in the in the in the inside. Oh, okay. like stuffed. 
With uh-huh. like zucchini, uh-huh. zucchini, tomato, eggplants, olive oil. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What does it mean? What does it, what does it call? Ratatouille. 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 Yeah. French. Dish. I think it's French, yeah. It's yeah. French. Ratatouille. Uh-huh. Yeah. But it has, you know, the similar vegetables that you have in the summertime. Like eggplant, tomatoes, peppers, things like that. Mm-hmm. Yummy. Mm-hmm. Okay. Good. Yummy. All right. I think we have time for at least one more. So, um, Andre, do you want to uh, think of something for us to guess? Uh, maybe I can try. Uh, as I understand, the mineral is uh, every object that is made from metal. Thing. Right? Yes. Pretty much yes. anything that is not considered in the vegetable category or in the animal will just include it in the mineral. So it's, it's it, we call it a catch all. It means like everything else goes there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I got it. I got it. <laughs> okay, cool. So is it a mineral? Then? Yes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's a mineral. Okay, Claudio, why don't you ask the first question, please? Um, do you find it on mines? No, it, no. In mines? Okay. It, it is in made mines. from metal, but... Uh, okay. okay. So it's made from metal, but you're, he's oh. not talking specifically about a mineral. Oh. Yeah. It can be something man-made or, you know, whatever. Kervan? Is it sharp? Is it sharp? Um, it consists of many parts, so maybe some parts are sharp. Hmm. Okay. Rosia? Mm. Is it made of uh, so is it made of from uh, from a uh, from men? From uh, I don't know how to it say is, it in English. Yeah, it, is, yeah. it is a man man made. Man made. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Okay, yes, it is man made. Man made. Yuki. Yes. Is it some kind of a device? Watur? Um, device or tool? Do, do you device. mean like a Yuki? You have to make it a yes or no. Do Maybe you mean like an electronic device or like a tool, like a hammer or something like that? Yes, tool. Uh, is it a tool? Is it a tool? Okay. No, it's not a tool. Tool. Uh, I mean, uh, in everyday usage, you mean uh, for? Yeah, tools. Like, yeah, let's let's make sure we know because in English, of course, we have lots of different things that yeah. can be used as a yeah. tool. But generally, this these are like tools right here, like saw, hammer. Mm-hmm. Okay. No, no, it's not. It's not a tool. Okay. A computer, it's a tool. Exactly. That's the other th- way you can talk about it. But we're gonna we're gonna use the word tool to represent like uh, tools you work with your hands with. So it's not one of those. Mm-hmm. Okay, Claudio. This a mobile phone. <laughs> That's not a tool. That would be an electronic device. Oh, okay. So that that's why I wanted to make sure because we have to okay. figure out make sure we're use we're understanding the same words. So the electronic devices would be these things. Cameras, phones, computers, remote control for your TV. Do we like use that. it do we use it to communicate each other? Um uh, no. no. So its main in its main function uh, is not for uh, communication. Okay. But you can use it for it. Uh, in uh, some meaning, you use it for communication, but uh, the main goal is not to communicate. Okay. Okay.
maybe I made it too difficult. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Kervan, do you it's have a, a question? It's a, compl it's a very complex object. Yeah. Ask me about size. About size. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Kervan, do you have a question? Do we uh, have it at home? Do we have it at home? No. 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 No, we don't have it at home. It won't fit. <laughs> it won't fit in your house. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, I have an idea. Mm -hmm. Is it... Ah, sorry. <laughs> Go ahead. Is it for transportation? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, is it a truck? No. Yuki? Oh... Uh, uh. Is it a bicycle? No. No. No, yeah, it's, it, it's supposed to be very big because it fit, it doesn't fit in your house. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. That's yeah, right. your bicycle could fit in your house. Ah, so cool. Can it fly? Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <now Yay>. <laughs> Kervan, it can fly. Uh, it's fly. <laughs> what? Wow. We've had, we have only one object that's yeah. flying. <laughs> yes. We only have one object that flies. Two. How many? At least I, two. I guess. I guess. Uh, yeah, ah, the no. obvious one. We have other. How many ones? people uh, can? Uh, uh, able to use it. Uh, it depends. Yes, no it depends answer. on the object ah. because. Oh I, well, we have to ask it in a yes or no way, so yes. it would be no more yes like: only. Can a lot of people Hello. fit on there? On uh, in yes. it? Can a lot of yes. people fit in it? Yes. Okay. So yes, a lot of people can fit in it. What else you? Yeah, I see the plane. Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking maybe it was a rocket or something before you before the question that a lot of people can fit in it. <laughs> I, I'm yeah. not sure that uh, every part is made of metal because I think it's made from uh, some kind of plastic, but yes, some parts yeah. are metal uh, too. I think. Yeah. Like alumi aluminum or some. Aluminum. Yeah. Uh, aluminum. Yeah. Exactly. Which, which part uh, from the uh, plane is uh, sharp? Like wings, maybe. Like wings, yeah. No, car now carbon fiber is used. Many, carbon fiber. Uh, it is in many parts mm -hmm. to the propellers to reduce the weight. Yeah, the propellers is really sharp. <laughs> engines, uh, engines are I think uh, metal. Are metal from yes, metal. Yes. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. I mean. The plane is a big topic, so uh, lots of different types of planes are made. So some probably have more metal, like an older one, you know, has more metal than a newer one, or like the propellers right here. Maybe those are metal. I don't know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Has everybody yes. flown on a plane? Yuki, I know you have flown on a plane. Rocio, have you yes, flown on a plane? Yes. 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 A lot of times. A lot yeah, of times. Yeah. Kid yeah. yeah. yes. Yes. Claudio? Yeah. And Andre? Yes, of course. Nobody's afraid of flying? No. Good. No. Liars, <laughs> 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 you liars. <laughs> liars. No. <laughs> no, as long as you get a drink or something. <laughs> <laughs> yes. What about you, you Lisa? Um, yeah, I've flown a lot. I've flown a lot, but I must say that I'm more afraid of flying. Not so much now, but for a few years I was a little bit afraid, but I think that's because I had little babies, like little kids, oh. and so I like didn't want to oh. die and leave my oh. kids. But now they're <laughs> older, so they'll be fine without me. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't want to die, but 
um, I had a, I had a student, um, a private student, and who's a pilot in Brazil. So in talking to him a lot, I feel more comfortable because now I have more inside information about, you know, how the planes work, and so yeah. But when I was younger, I didn't care at all. I flew to Europe and you know long trips, but. But as I was an adult, I became more afraid. What am I doing 30,000 feet up in the air in this thing over the water? That's crazy, you know. <laughs> but pretty normal nowadays. So, yeah. Okay, guys, we finished our hour, and there's other classes going on, so I want to finish up if you guys want to go to another class. And I have two more classes today. If you're awake and you want to join me, then I'll be happy to have you again. Otherwise, maybe I'll see you... Uh, during the week, and if I don't see you, have a Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, have fun with your families, your friends, whatever you do. You too. <laughs> you too. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.